Hello everyone, let me walk you through the demo of Facebook catalog and Instagram shopping integration in Odoo by Browseinfo. This application allows you to seamlessly connect your Odoo e-commerce store with Facebook shop and Instagram shopping. With this integration, your Odoo products can be automatically synced and showcased on Facebook and Instagram, boosting product visibility and helping you reach a wider audience. It's a powerful tool to drive traffic from social media to your store and increase sales. So first of all, we will go into the website, open that. Here, under e-commerce, we will go into the products. Here you can see I have created one product laptop open that and in here you will find a tab for Facebook data click on that and here you need to add the condition what is the condition of the product so I will be adding new under that you need to add the Google product category for that so it is laptop so I have selected electronics otherwise you can select accordingly now under e-commerce only we will find a product data feeds so I have created one product data feed here. You need to give the title. You need to give the model. You need to select the file format here. You can select CSV or XML and for the model also you can select the product template or either. Now under that you can see a redirected URL is generated here. You can see under product data feeds. You need to add the language currency and website. Now, after filling all the information, you need to click on generate token button. Now, as soon as we click on that, you can see an access token is generated. Now we will go into our meta account. You need to create a meta account. So in here, we will go into the settings under data resources. We will go into the catalogs, open that. And here you will find a button for add items. So click on add items and you will be redirected to the commerce manager. Here you will find a button for add products. Click on that. And here you need to select the preference option. I will be selecting data feed. Now click on next. And here you need to add the URL or Google sheet. So we will go into our Odoo interface and here you can see a redirected URL is uh, updated. So just copy that and we are going to paste it in here. Now after this, you can see the logging details. If you want to set the username and password, you can do it. Otherwise it is optional. Now click on next. And now here you can see a confirm setting wizard will open. Here you need to select your default currency, which is USD for mine. So I will be selecting USD. Now after this, just click on upload button. Here you can see your data being your data feed is being created and here it is being uploaded. So here you can see one updated or added item. So to see this, we will go into the items here under catalogs. And we are just going to refresh our page and in here under filters, we are going to select all items. So here you can see the product laptop, which is updated in your meta account from Odoo interface. Here you can see your product. So if I go into my Odoo interface under site, if we go into the home page, into the shop here, you can see our product. Here you can see the product laptop, which is $1,000 with its price. So in here you can see the title and the price of your product in the meta account. If you scroll down here, you will see one website link. If you click on that link, you will be redirected to the Odoo interface website page. Here you can see the Odoo interface website page for the laptop. Here you can see the title and the amount and under that only in meta account you will find a google product category which is electronic which we have added into our e-commerce products if you have any queries about this video you can ask them in the comment box and we will solve your queries if you feel this video is useful to you please like share and subscribe to our youtube channel for more odoo related videos thanks for watching